to my presentations over free martinism. So free martinism is when a genetically female fetus is masculinized in the presence of a male co-twin giving rise to a sterile heifer. Um, so generally this causes uh, the infertility of the female caused by its male co-twin. So the defects for the female generally include um, the general, or they're usually in the genital tract. Um, they can include suppression and disorganization of the ovary and sometimes they can originate a rudimentary testis like gonad which is depleted of germ cells. And they can also include a continuity between the uterus, the continuity between the uterus and the vagina um, to be absent. So this is caused by the placental fluids that are exchanged between the two fetuses, which causes a transform, transfer of hormones and antigens, which causes the female's reproductive tract to be underdeveloped and can sometimes cause them to express um, male reproductive system-like traits. 90% um, of the time, the female is completely infertile. It has been seen in some cases that the male can have reduced fertility, but most of the time, this um, if there's a female twin and a male twin, it's usually the female that's affected. So diagnosis is usually done by a physical examination. Um, external genitalia usually presents as an enlarged clitoris, a small vulva, and prominent male-like tufts of hair. Um, blood can be drawn to look for an increase of male hormones or a low amount of female reproductive hormones. Genetic tests can also be done to look for a Y chromosome present in the female, but most of the time they can, farmers can really only afford or can do a physical examination, so most of the time they'll do the physical examination, and it's usually assumed that a female born to male twin is sterile. So there is no treatment or cure for this. The female is just sterile, so she has no reproductive value, and they grow in a similar way as a castrated male, so the female may be culled off from their reproductive reproduction stock, and they usually grow just as well as a castrated male will for beef production, that, so that's usually then the category that they're put into. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're even citing me. Oh, that's I sweet. Am. Isn't that <laughs> nice? <laughs> okay. Any questions for my audience? I have no questions. Okay. Yeah. No, it's a. Uh, Rebecca, are you familiar with?